Hello everybody, welcome back to my Warfare and GTA Vice City Definitive Edition 100% So we're going to be doing the Kaufman Cabs mission, so we need to get in the taxi to start Okay, we got a high class fare and he's picking up from Starfish Island Any takers? Call me here, I'll take it Okay, so Now with these missions, the, the way they only start is by you getting in the taxis But it has to be a Kaufman Cab to start the mission but eh? Alright, so we need to go and get the VIP then from Starfish Island, so we're gonna do that. Now, there's only three of these uh, Kaufman Cabs missions, and I think they're actually not that bad, to be honest. They don't, they're not hard or anything, like, they actually seem easy. So yeah, they're not even that hard to do. But eh? Alright, here we are. This is my fare. Back off, asshole. Okay, so we need to try and uh, get the VIP back. Alright, this should probably help. Since we shot his wheel. He's running him over. Alright, so now let's get into the airport then. So yeah, this mission is pretty much as simple. You just get there, shoot him, shoot the taxi driver, get him in your taxi and take him to the airport. So yeah, so even though we're going to try and finish off all the uh, assets in this video. So, um... So we can have some money coming. So yeah. But anyways. Right, let's go across. Whoa. Nearly went over the cup, but luckily he dodged out the way. And here we are. I am a oh, Alright, mission complete. Alright then, let's go back to the um, cab place and order the next Kaufman Cabs mission. Blowing all cars, we're losing fares all over town. What's with you guys? VC cabs keep beating us to it. They just got too many cars. We can't compete. Mr. Bassetti, if you're out there listening in, you wanna put some VC cabs out of action before we go bust? Alright, so we need to go and destroy three rival taxis then. Now the one thing about this mission is that um, you don't have to be in the Kaufman cabs after the mission starts. You can get out and use any other vehicle. But I'm going to do it the normal way, I'm going to stay in the taxi anyway, so... So the one thing to do... Is, right, he's going to try and go over to Starfish. No, you are not. Is that when you hit them, they actually start following you. So, I think that's what we're going to do then. So, we're going to get him to follow us. So, now he should follow me. Yep. So, that's what we're going to do. So, we're going to get all these taxis to follow us. And then, hopefully, we can get them all in one. Now, I can blow them up all in one. There we go. Now let's get the third one to follow us. There we go. Just put myself up. Done. Alright. 
Let's go into the next cabs mission. Car 13, we got a missed car test. Ask for you especially. Okay, I got it. Car 13, out. Go and pick up the seat. Okay. So, we're going to skip ahead there anyway, so I'll see you there. Alright, here we are. No sign of Mercedes. Right, so we need to survive this now. So all we do is just survive for one minute. And then hopefully... Yeah, just like that, as long as they keep crushing. We did it. It's time for Kaufman's cab, Guardian Angel, to eat some fender. Right, now we're going to take out the leader. Whoa. Okay, we did it. Alright. So, we've done all the taxi missions. Alright. So, I guess we'll now go and start the uh, print works missions then. Mr. Mercedes? Hey, you bought the old print works? Yeah, my old man used to work on these. And I used to spend the evenings with him cleaning the rollers. I was gonna follow him in his trade, but I lived a different life. You planning on selling the old machinery? Breaking it down? I'm thinking we might print something. A newspaper, a magazine. Oh, crap, Sonny. Low-grade crap. I've always fancied printing money. It ain't too hard. You know, I've been doing it on a small scale for years. Really? Sure. But we need some good quality plates. Of course. There's a counterfeiting syndicate already operating in Florida. A syndicate? Yeah, with just rumors is all I've heard. I know a man who's good with rumors. Okay, so we're now starting with the print works. What the? Right, I guess we're driving there then. <laughs> okay then, so see you there.
let's get that money first. Right. So let's get over to the uh, shipping company. Right, see you there. Here we are. Away then. Nobody up here. Come on, man. You join us. Right, here we are. Who are you? Whoa, I know the face, know the face. Oh, I talk, I talk. Oh, I talk, I talk. Right, let's get the information back then. You all live to see them all. Whoa. Whoa. Right. I'm gonna try something. Get the, get the armor and the health. We're good. Go shower with the guys. Right. Let's get the stuff back. So yeah, we got the plates information. Let's go. Whoa. The VCPT, VCPD cheese. I can't bloody speak. What the? Oh, it's another one. Let's do the next print works mission then. All right, the courier's moving the plate from the docks today. I'm gonna go intercept them, grab the plates, lose any heat, and make my way back here. Now, depending how well this goes, we may have five minutes to print the money before the counterfeit syndicate finds us, or we may have all year. Either way, I want green rolling off the presses five minutes after I get back. Got it? Don't you worry, Tommy. We'll be ready. Me and the boys will be around in the neighborhood in case you need any heat taken care of. All right, everybody cool? All right, I'll catch you later. All right. All right, let's make our way down to the dock then, so... All right. Let's get the sniper out, then. Kill him! Most of them then? I'm not supposed to. Well, they have a lot of money though. Is there another one somewhere? Oh, there you are. Alright, there's she is in the helicopter. Get the plate! No, you're not. Right. And let's just use the helicopter to get back. One thing I like that this helicopter seems to take off more faster than the original. That's the only thing I can say good about it. But still, though. Right. Right. 
right, print works asset completed. And we can make eight eight thousand from it. Nice. Right then. So what we'll do now, we'll go over to the ice cream factory and we'll do that one next. Tommy, 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 I had Sonny on the phone, okay? Are you with me? I don't know about you, but there's something about a man threatening to murder my family which really scares the crap out of me. What are you gonna do? Ken, take it easy. I am calm. Calm as a man can be when he's fearing for his life. Stay off the idiot fuel and look after yourself. No one's gonna take us out. I'll see you later. I am calm. Don't I sound calm? Must be impending death that is doing this to my voice. Alright, let's get in here then. Distribution. So we want, what you want to do, activate the jingle. Now, the, the best place to do this is near the uh, Sunshine Autos and the docks. But I like to go to the sh near the sun Sunshine Autos since I'm right near like the paint spray and some open grass. But this is pretty much the simple because all you pretty much need to do is to sell at least 50 ice creams. And then that's all you put, pretty much need to do. Now you will get the cops on you when you do this so it's not going to be just that simple so just remember that. Alright so I'm just going to show you what happens when you get a wanted level and I'm show you what, what you can do to lose them. Alright no customers okay. Alright some customers here. But just keep a good lookout for cops as well. Right, now if you do get a wanted level, all you pretty much need to do, just drive down here. And that's all you need to do. Just dr drive around here, until you've lost a wanted level. Because no cops will come down here. There we go. And then as soon as you've lost them, you go back up there to make your sales. So I'm going to skip ahead till I've got at least 50 sales, because you need to do 50 anyway, so I'll see you once I've done 50. Alright, there we go, we've done 50. Right. And there we have it. Ice cream factory asset completed. And we can make three grand from it. Okay. Right. So anyways, so now let's go to the boatyard. Alright, checkpoint Charlie, let's go. Alright. Alright, so we need to collect all the uh checkpoints around the sea whilst we're on this boat now when you get to this ramp you want to slow down when you hit the jumps so don't rush the jumps just slow down on them like that we're trying not to dock on to the uh, thing this one is okay to go fast on all right So all we gotta do is pretty much collect all the uh, checkpoints whilst you're on these boats. So I recommend the Squallow because I think the Squallow will have a more chance so make sure you s to use the Squallow. Alright, I don't even know if we're nearly done now. Well, nearly there. Gotta cut round a few times. Whoa, okay boat. I think the waves are trying to make it a bit harder. Oh well. God, they really made the boats really fast. We'll still be able to do it anyway, we've got enough time.
Right, and we're about to do it. Alright, boat yard asset completed. And we can get $2,000 from the boat yard. Okay. Nice. Alright, so far we've done pretty much all the assets at the moment, but except um, Phil, Phil's, bleh, Phil Cassidy and the Presetti Estate. So we're going to do them as well, so uh, what we'll do now, we will start with Phil's mission, since there's only two of them. And I think the Facetti Estate only has two as well, since we did Shakedown Way a bit earlier, so we'll do Phil's next, so let's go and do his. Phil! Run! Run! Wait! Never get a naked slave too close to one of Phil Cassidy's moonshine steals. Shit, Phil. Did you drink that stuff? The hell, you don't have to drink it. Just a good whiff will set you off. Wee. Listen, Phil, you said you could fix me up with some firepower. Sure thing. There's some Mexican gun runner been doing me for business of late. He does his weekly run about now. <clears throat> hey. Ram his hardware off the back of his trucks before he goes to ground. And you'd be doing me a favor while you're at it. Then finish him off. Okay, and uh, we'll take these, why not, as they're free. Right. <coughs> Alright, so all we got to do is to uh, shoot the <coughs> guns off the back of the vans and take the weapons. Yo, Edson, what are you doing driving like that? Let's actually try and find the others first. <coughs> Destroy these. Right, let's just have these destroyed first. Right, let's let's see if we can destroy the other ones then. I keep touching the mic, I need to stop. <coughs> you also get a bonus as well in this mission, which we are gonna do as well. But I think we need to pick up some weapons first before we do that. But let's just get rid of these first. some weapons and they have called him back up so we'll go near the uh, old weapon set and then we'll um, get the bonus there we are these people on scooters they'll give you the bonus so we'll do that indeed <coughs> all, right. all right we'll get the other weapon in a minute the moment to get a bonus then. Where are they? Don't think I can get up from here. Oh well, never mind, we'll just guess guess we'll just pick it up. There we go. Yeah, I thought we could have got the bonus, but never mind. Alright, we should get a phone call, so we're gonna wait for that. Listen to me, you hear? Good. I got
got me some extra strength of boonshine. It's nearing fermentation time, and I was wondering if you'd fancy having a shot. Seriously, Tommy. If you like a drink, or if you need to strip paint, this stuff will make a man out of you. Sure did out of me, even though I can't see out of one eye. I'll be waiting for you. You hear? Hey, Phil. How's it going? Hey, Tommy! How you doing? This bitch is on. I swear you should lay off that boom shine, man. It smells like paint stripper. It's making my eyes burn. Shh, 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 Tommy. Hey, come over here because there's something I want to show you. Something. Oof, God, should I be able to smell that from way over here? Feeling Don't boom. you worry about the Phil, smell, oof. Tommy. You just watch this. Shitty, cheap bandages or something. There's some more on the bench. Ta-da! Oh, damn! <laughs> well, you lost your arm, Phil. Right, so we need to get you to the hospital then. Okay. Officer Source. Not the hospital, man. Too many cops in Viet Cong. There's an ex army surgeon who owes me a few favors and a lawnmower. He's got a place down Little Havana. Oh, look, giant fish. Broken spoon. Come out of here. You got it. What's happening here? Alright, here we are. We did it. So that was how Phil lost his arm. And Phil's asset completed. And we can now buy weapons from his place. Alright, and... Right, so what we'll do now, I guess we will now finish off the, uh, the, the Frasetti estate mission, so let's get back to the mansion. Tommy, it's Phil. I want to thank you for helping me out back there, son. Damn Charlie, he'll always ambush you somewhere or the other. Anyway, the wound is healing well, and it means I'll no longer be defrauding the government on my disability check. What's the problem? Some bars refusing to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. But don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. All right. <clears throat> All right. Now, we, you don't really need to bring these two, but um, I thought why not anyway, Get as it's the, the mission. Alright, so let's make our way down back to uh, Ocean Beach, so I'll see you there. Alright, here we are. Alright, let's go and speak to the bar owner. Your protection needs a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again. I don't need this crap. These idiots operate out of DDP security around the block. You guys just sort it out amongst yourselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. All right. Let's go then. Back in the car. All right, so we need to go and take out the security then. Alright, 
Let's get this then. There we go, make it easier. Well, I think that coal's gonna explode. Alright, nope, I'm not gonna take that core this time. So I'm gonna take this instead. Sorry, man, leave you behind. <laughs> right. Alright, so all we gotta do now is take out these people on the bikes. Whoa. What's wrong with them? What the? Well, you just made it easier for me, thank you very much. <laughs> Alright, I'll be having your bike too. Alright, now before we do the next Vercetti mission, I think we get another phone call, I think, so we'll wait for that first. Tommy, we gotta talk about stuff. What's the problem, Lance? It's you, my friend. I feel you're not giving me a fair slice. And more than that, you've been embarrassing me in front of the boys. I can't have that. Lance, it ain't like that. You've been making mistakes. Tommy, I'm not your message boy. I'm not your running boy. Lance, don't screw up and we won't have any problems. I screw up, you can lay into me any time. Tommy, I've done everything for you. You treat me like a fool. Don't do that. Lance, I won't rip you off or stab you in the back, okay? Just take it easy. This is tough enough without you getting all emotional on me. Trust me. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I hear you, Tommy. But I can't take this much more. Lance... Don't be like this. Now I'm warning you. Do you hear me? Just relax. Take a few days off. Okay? I'll talk to you. You moron! What were you thinking? Do you realize what this means? We could all be so- I don't know. The timer must have got screwed. That place was wired to go up like a firework factory. And somebody tipped off the cops, but everything What's the problem, apart. fellas? Mike was supposed to torch some place in the mall, but he screwed the fuses, and now oh, the yeah, cops are crawling all over it. We gotta get our stuff and get out of here. Relax, both of you. Let me think for a second. Tommy Versetti just doesn't cut and run. The cops are gonna be going over that building with a fine-tooth comb, right? But that takes time. We gotta go in and torch that place ourselves. Yeah, but... No one but a cop could get within a mile of that place. So we go as cops. We gotta get uniforms and we're gonna need a squad car. All thanks to you, Mike. I'm sorry. I got it. All we gotta do is lure the cops in with the finger, put them in a locker, and jump them. Good plan. Let's go. All right. Okay, Lance, let's get the cops' attention. All right. So what I'm gonna do for this mission, I'm gonna take my uh, sea sparrow. So uh, anyways, that I got from him packages. Right. <clears throat> okay, good thing it's still there. Hope Lance doesn't get stuck in the pool now. Right, get in then. Right, so yeah, we're gonna use this sea spell. So I'll see you over there. Let's land it just here. Right, so we need to start getting police attention. Now that got them really irritated. Right, there we go. Right, that's one cop. Right, we need another one. Right, in the locker. There we go, we did it. Tie him up and gag him. Ooh, fits perfect. Bit tight around the crotch, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, mine too, mine too. There you go, can plant the bomb. Now, a good thing about this mission is that you don't need to actually take a police car. You can actually take whatever vehicle you want. Which is why I'm still going to take my helicopter. I could take the police helicopter and done it in style, but even though. But I've got this now anyway, so. See so ya. Yeah. Alright, but I'm gonna land it um, somewhere around here though. Let's land it 
like here or something? Or maybe just up here? Alright, there we go, leave it there. Let's, let's put the weapons away. Remember, smile at the other cops. Hey there, officer. Nice back. Nice back. Real smooth, Lance. Right. There it is. Nice badge. Okay, timers are set. Five seconds and ticking. There we go. Right, there's Lance. Right, let's go. Right, let's get out of here then. Where's Lance? Lance? Where are you? There you are. Alright, come on Lance, let's go. Alright, good. Right, let's go. Alright, the helicopter's still there, that's good. Alright, Lance is with us, that's good. Alright, get in. Alright. All we gotta do is just fly back. So yeah. So you don't have to take the police car. Just take whatever vehicle you want. I don't know why the game tells you to take a police car, but even though. Which better to take a helicopter. I remember the first time I played this, I just randomly took a helicopter. I didn't know you could actually take a police car. So yeah, that's why I knew you could take any vehicle. So yeah, it makes it easier to do it this way. It doesn't have to be the sea spell, but you can use any helicopter. Even the one from the top of your mansion. go. Oh. Protection, protection ring asset completed. Nice. There we go. Right. So, now I think we should now get some phone calls. So we're gonna wait for them phone calls first. Hey, hello, Tommy, Tommy. We got a situation over at Printworth. You better go and check it out. I don't know, some kind of mess or other. Things are messed up. I gotta go. Tommy, it's me, Lance. Keep your mouth shut there, Tommy, because I ain't got no time to talk. I ain't interested in what you gotta say. Why should I be? You don't care about me, do you? You gotta look after me a bit better. Give me a spare slice, you know? You tell me, man. Look, hey, I'm sorry. It's just that people patronize me all my life, treat me like a little kid. My brother would do that. Please, man, don't do that. I gotta go. Okay, so, um, as you see as well, we've also now got another Printworks mission, but, um, what we're gonna do, we're gonna leave that one till way later on, till the end of the game. So, so we're gonna leave that Printworks way later on, till the end of the game. But other than that though, I think we'll probably end it off here then, since we've now done all the asset missions. So, in the next episode, we'll probably start with the assassination missions, which is the payphone missions. So, without the way, thank you for watching, and I'll see you lot in the next one. Take care.